Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or if you're new, hi, hello, I'm Raya and thank you so much for tuning in. So today I'm going to be showing you a Shein haul on leather dresses, I've just got them at the back here. And if you aren't already subscribed, maybe consider subscribing for more videos on fashion and lifestyle every single week. So without further ado, let's get into it. I think I'm going to start from the my least favourite to my favourite to last. I haven't tried any of these on by the way, but just looking at them I can tell you which one is my favourite. So let's start with this one so i don't know what possessed me when i saw this online it looked much better on the models so like expectations versus reality and all that it's interesting it might i don't even know this is gonna fit me i picked it up in a size small it doesn't have a zip and i hate dresses which don't have zips but the colour really got me and I really like this colour. I feel once we're out of lockdown, everyone's going to be going out. So this would be perfect for going out, going out for dinners and stuff like that. So it actually looks a lot better on than it did on the hanger. It looks a lot cheaper on the hanger. But now I've got it on, it doesn't, like, it's not too bad. I'm not wearing a bra with it because I find it's a little bit fitted around here. But around like this area, there's loads of give to this, loads of stretch. So I don't know if I love it though. I mean, I think around the bottom bit, it's quite flattering. So this is the back. And I think if the ruching kind of stopped midway or it had a nicer, I don't know, start at the back, it'll be a lot better. At the front here, it's nice, but I don't think I love this. Do you know what I mean? And I like the way it looks, but I don't love the way it sounds. It's doing that plasticky thing where you kind of... Can you hear that? So, this dress is really, really lovely. I love this kind of boned kind of corset detail. It's just... It's not really bone, well no it is a tiny bit and there's, I think it's, like it feels like an underwire, I don't really know. But I don't know if my boobs will actually fit in here, but again let's get it on. It's got spaghetti strap here, it's not adjustable, so that means, so that just means it's just going to sit how it sits. I don't think there's going to be any like adjustableness in that. So I feel like this dress is such a nice dress. But it's really loose around here. I picked this up in a medium and maybe I should have just gone with a small because this is like a stretchy dress so you can definitely maybe, I don't know, if you've got a smaller waist and size down and because it is stretchy you'll be absolutely fine. It kind of doesn't do me much justice or give me any support around here I find. But it, it's actually a really nice dress. It looks really, um, what's the word? It doesn't look cheap. Um, it looks quite, I don't know, I like it. And you know what? I'm actually gonna show you another way to wear this for the day. So if you don't wanna wear it like this and you think it's a bit too much, then hold on, I'm just gonna show you how to style it in a way that's kind of more wearable if you like. It doesn't look too bad. I thought it was gonna make the dress really cheap, but you know what? I don't think it does. So the quality of this looks really nice for faux leather. I have to say, I am quite impressed. I'm not happy about this bit, but I really wish, like, I'm looking for a dress like this that comes below my knee, so a little bit longer, but is all fitted around here. I think that's really cool. If you don't want to wear it on its own and you want to make it more, say, I don't know, day wear, you could actually get away wearing this during the day. This shirt actually makes it more wearable if you are kind of a bit more conscious about your arms and things like that. The next thing I've got here is this dress here. Again, it's a black leather. I'm on the hunt for this really nice leather dress and I really want like a pencil type of fitting dress. I just feel like that suits me so much uh, more than something like straight cut. I think I should probably look on the house CB but I just wanted to kind of see if I would find anything on a Shein because it popped up. So it does have a concealed zip here. I've just opened it up for you guys. Quite nice here. I don't know about this. It, the straps on this are actually adjustables and it's a leather strap unlike the other dress which was just like a basic spaghetti dress. I think I picked it up in a medium and I'm really pleased that I did because it fits lovely. It's not too much but what I will say is that I quickly ran downstairs to go and get something and when I walked back up the stairs the dress literally rolled up really badly. So just 
be mindful if you're going to wear this out in public or if you are going to be taking the tube and walking up or whatever up the stairs then it does rise and you'll be pulling you'll find yourself pulling it back down again i have paired this with a pair of stilettos but i will pair it with i will also pair it with chunky boots or if you have doc martens i think that's a really cool look you can wear it with a cardi on top if you like or a crop jacket but i've worn it with this longer jacket here which i love so much and it's quite light so i think for spring it's actually nice especially in the evening or if you're wearing this for an evening out in the summer so the next one is this dress i'm looking at this and it looked so nice on the model i'm gonna set a photo for you guys but again expectations versus reality it looks nice i did pick it up in a small these buttons look quite cheap i don't love these buttons i think if you do love this dress then you could definitely change these buttons up just get them from like a haberdashery or them online so this is the belt i don't think i'm gonna wear it with this because i have something very similar um, but i just think it's cool that it comes with a belt. This is like paper thin. Do you remember those like watches when you were a kid that you would like slap on your wrist and it would just go all the way around? This is what this reminds me of. But it's too tight here, so I'm actually just going to wear this open and wear it like this. I don't, I definitely think this dress is going back, so I don't really like, like this. I think if it was, if it, I, maybe if I went up a size and changed the buttons, but personally, I do not like the buttons. It's cute as a little throwover, because you're probably seeing everywhere, pretty much everywhere, they've got like these leather blazers. I find it more flattering on curvy and petite people in particular. But I am on the hunt for one. Now my absolute favourite, and I'm praying this fits, I picked it up in a small and I did read a couple of the reviews hearing that it had some nice stretch in it, but I'll see how it fits, um, but it does look gorgeous. When I say this looks gorgeous, this looks absolutely gorgeous, it's got the spaghetti straps, I don't actually know which way round this is going on. Wait, I don't understand. How am I gonna figure this out? So, like, I'm just gonna wear it how I wear it and hopefully um, it looks nice. I love the fact that it's got a concealed zip just at the back here and it's got a slit too. The lining does make it look a little bit cheap but really I don't know who's gonna be seeing that. I don't know whether I should wear black. Normally black and brown, I'm not too sure whether they go together but definitely a pair of heels with this because this is like an evening dress so what can i tell you about this dress first of all it is my favorite that's why i did save it until last um and i really love it i actually love the fact that it comes all the way down to my ankle to you it kind of focuses on the slimmest part of my body with the nude pumps i find that it doesn't shorten my legs quite nice this is definitely an outfit you're going to be wearing in the evening there's no way i would wear this out for like a brunch unless everyone was getting really doled up but i just i wouldn't wear it like during the day definitely an evening dress and i love this i wasn't too sure how to do the neckline with the spaghetti strap but this is actually how the model wears it i have to double check but i really like this i'm not wearing a bra with this dress and i feel like it does flatter me there's not too much support in the boob area but i think with this type of dress you're not exactly going to be like you know racing in it so you don't need to worry too too much like this dress does not reflect the price at all i have to say it has a very premium look to it it is so so stunning and i love the fact that it has concealed zip i love this chocolate color and i think this one is definitely going to be a keeper i don't know where i'm wearing it to but i'm going to make sure that i'm going out for dinner in the evening somewhere where i can wear this what did you guys think of the last dress by the way because i absolutely loved it so if you like the video please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and maybe consider subscribing if you want already for more videos every single week and thank you so much for watching and i will see you soon bye